Hey everyone, it's your buddy Graphic back with another video, and today we're going to be showing you guys some 2v5 gameplay from the closed betas. So obviously, a lot of you guys that have been kind of following this channel for a little bit, you guys noticed that I did play Rapier and Firestaff quite a bit. I like the mobility it kind of gave you and also the idea of being so good in PvE as well as in PvP. Um, so here you're going to actually see a 2v5 fight. I just kind of want to talk my way through this one as we're getting hyped back up for the open beta coming out. And like I said, what, one to two days now. So we are getting very, very close depending on when this video actually goes up today or I guess uploads. But here you're starting off, you're seeing just a 1v2. I'm kind of missing a lot of abilities to be honest, but that's another reason why I love this build. It's actually very, very forgiving because of so much mobility. You're able to get in and out of fights very, very quickly. The only thing I do probably right now do not like about the rapier is there is pretty much no homing. So if you auto attack with maybe a great axe or even a spear or anything, you can actually get autos to land very, very easily. If you notice with the rapier, you'll miss a lot of autos. It's very, very hard to hit consecutive autos at times. And uh, you have to be pretty much right up next to them, which makes a little bit of sense because, you know, there is a lot of benefits to having the rapier. So right there, getting that repost, I could have actually rolled behind him, got a nice crit, but I would have taken a lot of damage, and I don't think I would have lived and gotten another kill after that, possibly. So I do keep trying to kite instead. One thing you'll notice is, like I said, the mobility, you usually use the fire staff to actually go through them, do damage, and use movement to your advantage. So here I almost have a kill. I get the rapier, backstab, 1 HP, and do I end up getting the kill? Uh, you'll find here in a second that I do miss my fireball, so I missed the kill yet again. So the 2v5 continues on, and it may not look like there's five different people here. I will say, guys, the the uh, I think there's two or three people that show up here in just a second. I think it might be just a 1v3 or 1v2 right now. But realistically, this is a fight, and uh, this so it looks like it's at least three. But this is one of those kind of fighting uh, techniques that I love. It's just constant kiting against three people that want to take you down, and it. It's a lot of fun. It's obviously, like I said, a way to outplay is playing a very high mobility build. Um, so I just use keep, like I said, keep using that uh, burnout to my advantage on damage as well as mobility. They are healing. They have healing staffs. So that's another reason why I haven't killed anyone quite yet. Um, and then also that repost was pretty terrible. I probably could have easily got a kill or two there. Um, if I hit that repost on multiples at the same time, you can see I finally do get a kill there and use my burnout to finish him. It is nice to get the finishes on these kills because with five people, they would easily be able to send one person over to pick up while, uh, you know, I'm just getting chased around here. That was a very, very bad flesh by me. I actually flashed right into the ice shower, which could have been the end of me. I don't think they actually took the correct ability, which would have been an heavy attack that could have actually held me straight up right there. So you're seeing the strength of this build right now. And like I said, this 2v5 as a covenant is on the right side taking out one of the uh, one of the marauders, I believe, as I'm syndicate in this clip specifically. Um, but like I said, you're seeing how really strong this build can be. I do have build guides on this specific build. Obviously, we do have patch notes coming hopefully tomorrow at the very latest. Uh, so we are excited about that. And uh, I will obviously cover those patch notes as well and tell you guys what I'm thinking for uh, really what's going to be the strong build going into release. But right now, you can see that they get back up. So two more people coming into play. Um, and really, I should have probably killed almost all of them by now. I'm missing, like I said, a ton of abilities on the fire staff. Here I do hit a nice R, so I am able to get this kill as well as I throw my fireball to finish. And I just really get out, uh, you know, out, not outplayed specifically, but uh, really just outnumbered and finally it ends there. So thank you guys again for tuning in. I just want to talk a little bit about PvP and show you guys that there is still so much outplay potential with some of these builds. It's going to, it's, it's going to be a lot of fun. I'm excited for the future of PvP. Thank you guys again. I'll see you all in the next one.